Hi everyone, today I'm showing off a brewing machine. It's designed by Etho, and in fact he hasn't even finished it yet. But I just saw his video and um, started building it. So it looks like this. It's controlled by this hopper timer, which you can manually turn on or off. And um, every 20 seconds it will take water bottles from here and put them into this brewing stand. And after 20 seconds they will be they will travel up here into this chest and after another 20 seconds they will go into the into the next brewing stand. And um, this will be repeated until they end up here and go to your storage system. Um, this um, timer controls um, two machines at the moment and they have only a one wide gap in between. This is because the, the hoppers apart from in between here and this line is powering both sides at the same time and the droppers apart from below by this torches and this two tick clock um, I have um, built this segment to show off how it works. So um, you have your water bottles in this chest and the hopper is currently powered by this repeater which powers the red sun dust and this powers the block and the blocks the hopper beside it. And if you unpower the red sun up here, the hopper will suck up the water bottles out of this chest and put them into this brewing stand where they will start to brew. After 20 seconds they have finished brewing and are awkward potions now and then this um, changes again and um, they are sucked out of the brewing stand but currently um, this hopper is still powered by this torch which controls the dropper so if I power this once for um, bit too long to <laughs> here. Um, a potion will be sucked out and put into this dropper and um, put up into the next one and um, this um, two tick timer um, is runs for long enough to power these droppers five times which is enough to suck out all of the potions and put them all into the chest up here and um, you need to power them five times and not three times because they have to be sucked out first and yeah this is basically how it works. You can brew any potions you want. You have four slots, one for um, the nether ward, one for um, sugar or magma cream or whatever, blaze powder, anything you want. In the third chest you can put redstone or um, glowstone and in the fourth one you can put gunpowder if you want but you can just leave it empty. 
and uh, you can easily refill the water bottles by standing in here you just have to grab a bunch of bottles and fill up your inventory so all slots are blocked and then you have to go to survival and just hold down shift and right click so you put all the potions onto this hopper which will suck it up and put them into these chests where they will be stored until they're um, needed by the brewing stand and if the system has no water bottles left this comparator will um, will power will unpower this torch so it turns on and this disables the timer so you don't have too much lag while you don't brew any potions um, you only have to put the resources in here into the chest and then you can go AFK and when the water bottles run out it will automatically stop and if you log on again you will have enough potions for the rest of your life <laughs> and yeah this is pretty much everything there is to it you just need a 20 second hopper timer a monostable circuit a pars extender over here this um, repeaters on 2 and these over here are, are all on 4 ticks then you need a comparator and a repeater which will make a 2 tick clock to power this these droppers and up here the red you um, control the hoppers yeah this is basically it you need this upside down half slabs um, because you would power the droppers if you don't use them um cause um if you have um something that powers them diagonally it um it's a butt switch and it messes up all the machinery so you better use half slips to prevent this and um these comparator clocks um sometimes don't work I haven't tested it a lot with this two tick um, clock. I think they are pretty stable, but if you only use a one tick clock and put these repeaters on two ticks, it should work too, but for some reason it doesn't and sometimes it does, so it's um, unstable and so just use this two tick time and it works just fine okay so this is it i hope you liked the video if you did please give it a like maybe even um, add it to your favorites and yeah thanks for watching